Hey guys, this is Dapson Ishmael. In today's tutorial, we will take a look at how to use the QR code extension in WYSIWYG Web Builder version 16. So this um, extension actually allows you to um, have a QR code on your website, which when scanned with a phone, it then takes you to a certain web address. So let's go ahead and then open WYSIWYG Web Builder. Before you can begin, you first have to install the QR code extension and uh, using the extension manager. So you click on extension manager and then you click on all. It loads with the internet. And then once that section is done, you go ahead to search for QR code here. Now in my case, I already have it installed. So if I come back to all, you can see that I have it installed over here. So I'll go ahead and then close this window and then in my toolbox, I'll search for QR code. So that is it. I'll click on it and then draw on the canvas uh, on an empty space. And then to be able to change the settings for it, I'll go ahead and then double click on it. So when you double click on it, there are a couple of um, options available. The first um, two options are color. So you can change the color of this QR code from the black and white here to something different based on what you prefer. And then once you are done with that, you go ahead to select the size of it. So the height, um, you can increase this, you can decrease this based on where you're going to position it. So let me make this uh, 400 instead. And then once you're done, you notice that it has actually become, you know, huge based on the size that was um, selected. So this can be changed back to the default colors. And then the last option available here is the URL or the link where if someone scans this QR code with their phones or any QR code scanner, it is going to take them to that um, particular address. So over here, you can specify um, a web address. So let's say um, this. And then once I click on OK, and then I preview this in the browser, it is going to show me the you know, QR code over there. So on my phone, um, unfortunately, I won't be able to show that on my phone, but I'm trying to scan that with my phone to see what the result is going to be. So yeah, I'm actually scanning. And yeah, good. So I actually have the web address showing on my phone. So I can go ahead to tap on visit website on my phone and then it shows me that. So this is how to go about using the Kero Out Code extension and WYSIWYG Web Builder version 16. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.